Hi guys, welcome to Birmingham Bullet Fix. Now I've been asked to come and have a look at this back sea. It's a it's blowing the fuse. So we're gonna dig deeper and see what's going on with it, why it's blowing the fuse. Right, I've just seen some sparks and uh, I don't know if it was the fan or the actuator so I'm just going to disconnect both of them and then try again one by one Right, I'm going to switch, I'm going to connect the fan on now and then we're going to test it out and see what happens Okay, we found the problem. It's the fan. As soon as you switch the power on, it's sparking, so it's blowing the fuse. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna change the fan on this, and then we're gonna test it and see what's what else, if there's anything else wrong with it. Right, I've taken the old fan out, and uh, I'm just gonna change it to a new fan and then we're going to test it out Right, I've got the boiler working again. It's not blowing the fuse and the fan's working. Now the hot water's working fine too. So all good, everything's tested, working fine. But it's not the end of the story yet. I get called back the next day and they told me the boiler's broken down again. So I came back to check it out and there's water all over the boiler, including the circuit board. So how the water got in, I don't know. They're saying that they had a bath upstairs and must have leaked through through the ceiling into the boiler. So I've I had to sort it all over it, sort it out all over again. The circuit board had loads of water in it. What I had to do is get some get a hair dryer and so, and plenty of tissue to dry it all out and then hopefully test it out. Now if you've got any water on your circuit board or any of the electrical components on your, in the boiler, dry it out the best as you can. Uh, don't switch the power on till you've dried it out completely. And then switch the power on, otherwise it's just going to damage the boiler more. So after all that, we got the boiler working. Now ask the landlord to sort the leaks out, otherwise it's going to cause more damage to the boiler and it's going to cost him a lot more. But that's up to him now. Boiler's working fine now. Guys, if your boiler's broken down in Birmingham or South Birmingham or surrounding areas, give us a call. We repair domestic, commercial, and all your favorite boilers like Wayland, Baxi, Worcester Bosch, Ideal. So give us a call. Don't suffer in cold. I hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching. Till next time, keep smiling. Hopefully, that'll keep you happy.